I've lived in Hagerstown most of my life. I was born and raised here, and my wife Beth um, came to Hagerstown about 20 years ago when we met. And we met because of our love of bicycling. We met through the Cumberland Valley Cycling Club, which we are still members of. And there's no better place to live than Hagerstown if you enjoy the outdoors. The Cumberland Valley Cycling Club was formed in Hagerstown, Maryland 25 years ago. Even though we're a relatively small community, our club is so strong that we have several weekly rides for all different ability levels that leave from um, different locations. So everybody has a ride that they can participate in. We have wonderful scenic views out there in the country, a lot of good back roads with little traffic, and it's really magnificent riding. Do you remember when the club was first started? No, I've only been in it about 22 years. <laughs> so uh, some of the older guys, <clears throat> older guys can tell you more. <laughs> Dan, you are very young. <laughs> well, I'll be 73 in about uh, two weeks. See, that's what bicycling does oh, for you. Yes. You really get to see the scenery on a bicycle that you don't really see in a car or even a motorcycle. But uh, they really get out here and just see it and smell it, especially when you're going past the farms. <laughs> it's really, uh, it really opens your eyes up. Uh, it's peaceful to go out here and just pedal your stress away and get mm -hmm. your fit at the same time. Have fun! This is Joelle in Allenburg. She's actually my best friend. And what's your favorite part about riding in the Cumberland Valley area, aside from riding with me? Oh, well, of course that would be first. <laughs> um, I think like everyone else said, we just have some beautiful roads here that are still very much low traffic. You can go out and ride in the valley and do a not too difficult ride, or if you really want some challenge into the hills, you can do that also. Hey, how are you guys? Good, pretty good. This is Scotty Gordon on the left and Tim Lung on the right. I was one of the original, uh, I guess, founding members of Cumberland Valley Cycling Club. It's been so long ago, I don't re really remember a whole <laughs> lot about it. And Tim is one of the directors of the Antietam Velo Club, a racing arm of the club. Tell us how uh, all the activities that the Antietam Velo Club have influenced uh, cycling in the region. Well, we, we have both a racing team and uh, we promote races. And uh, really, I think what we have done is turned uh, Hagerstown, Washington County into a, a hotbed of cycle, bicycle racing. We offer races for everybody from the top level elite racers uh, clear down to just uh, entry level riders that want to give bike racing a try. And plus we, we do races for kids and everybody. Our biggest race promotion is the Tour of Washington County stage race and uh, it's really the only Tour de France style bicycle stage race in the whole Mid-Atlantic area. It's over the Father's Day weekend in June and it's four stages over two days and really it uh, showcases uh, Washington County and, the, and its small towns. It, it's been growing every year and uh, really has turned into one of the premier bike races in the whole Mid-Atlantic area. Wow, you guys are kicking it. I know that being in the Cumberland Valley Cycling Club for me, the last 20 years, it's, so it's almost like having another family. It's people that you get together with several times a week. We do special fun things all the time, and it really has been great. <laughs>